Financial chess or checkers? What game are you playing? Hi, my name is Kevin Corhorn. I'm one of the certified financial planners at Corhorn Financial Group and I'm one of the contributors to the Wise Money Radio Show. Uh, Mike Bernard is out for the week. He mentioned something about Infinity Stones and Captain America. I'm not sure exactly what he's doing, but he's busy for the week. He asked me to step in and I said, well, Mike, my day job, I just, I kind of just draw pictures and tell stories, so what should I do? And he said, well, do that. So I'd like to tell you a story and and make a connection between this story and your financial life. So um, I have two boys and a girl. My oldest is Joshua and he's in Iraq serving in the US Army right now. My middle son is Caleb and he's at the University of Michigan. My daughter is a senior in high school and she's just wrapping up her online school. So my boys over this past holiday really got into playing chess and every time I turned around they were playing each other on chess.com so you could you can play with someone in Niles, Michigan can play someone in Iraq a game of chess. It's fascinating and then I, I'm looking and Caleb's got his buddies over at the house and, and instead of doing what they normally do they are playing chess and chess 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 chess. So then I would um, I go to bed I, I, I go to bed fairly early and Caleb would either text me or call me and say, hey, Dad, do you want to play chess? And I, <laughs> I can tell you what the answer was, uh, but instead I said, sure, I'd love to. And so I'd go out to the kitchen table and he'd uh, beat me soundly a game or two. And so I think, okay, with the game of chess, I grew up playing chess, kind of, but I didn't really. I knew my knowledge of the game of chess was I knew what the pieces were and what moves you could do with the various pieces. But I didn't have any strategy whatsoever. So you say, okay, what does that have to do with your personal finances? I think there are lots of folks and we, we work with them. They might have an idea of how the game works. They might even know how some of the pieces move, but they don't have a strategy. So when you say, well, why would I work with a financial planner? And again, I say, if you're working with a financial planner, make sure they're certified. A lot of times people say, oh, I'm working with a financial advisor. All that person is doing is selling you investments. N not that that's a bad thing. And I'm not poking anyone in the eye who just sells investments. I have great friends who sell investments for a living and I think there's some um, there's some useful purpose in doing that but the way we see the world we want to look at the chess board and with chess the interesting thing that I've learned is you need to think three moves ahead and so it's tempting because I can't tell you how many times I've I've been watching a move I've been watching the move watching the move and then finally I get to do it and I take Caleb's knight or I take Caleb's rook and I'm like sweet I've been, I've been working on this for the last three moves and I finally did it. And then the next thing I know, he takes my queen. And I think, how in the world did that happen? And how in the world did I not see that? And I can tell you how, because I'm playing chess like someone would play checkers. I'm just looking and saying, just what's my next move? What's my next move? Well, to play chess, you need to be thinking three moves ahead. So in your financial life, how are you thinking three moves ahead? And how are you seeing the board? Because when I was growing up, I didn't have YouTube where I could listen to and watch grandmasters of the game teach me how to play chess. But guess what? The guys who are, are, are having a good time playing chess right now, they actually are, have the, the best chess players in the world giving them advice on how to do that. That's possible as well in your financial life. You can go on YouTube, you can go read books, you can do all kinds of things. Most people don't have a problem necessarily with the learning of these financial concepts, but how do they implement the strategy? So I would encourage you to think about your financial life and to consider, am I playing financial chess or am I playing financial checkers? If you're playing checkers, I would encourage you to have someone who can help you see the board and think three moves ahead. If you want to talk to us, feel free to call us at 574-222-2000. Uh, you can text uh, a question to us. You can email us info at corehorn.com. All right, there you have it. So now go ahead and take your next wise step.